it, run from it, destiny arrives all the same. And now it's here, or should I say, Hello and welcome back. New details have emerged on the New York's Manhattan billionaire financier's death of Thomas H. Lee, a longtime supporter and friend of no other than Bill and Hillary Clinton. Lee made his billions from buying big companies that found themselves in financial trouble and hardship over the years. Lee made billions by buying these companies and building their wealth back up and then selling them for big profits. Some of these mega companies that Lee purchased and sold was big names like Snapple, Quaker Oats, and other big billion dollar companies. A concerned friend and resident of the Sudden Palace apartment buildings in Manhattan that Lee owned who also served with the Wall Streeters, said that he was shocked by Lee's suicide death. He said, I knew Lee for 23 years and I never had any problems and was very well educated. He said Lee never had any problems. He was very well educated being a graduate of Harvard University. If I had a chance to pick somebody that would commit suicide, it would never be Lee. This is coming from a resident that is a longtime friend of Lee. The internet now is lighting up because here we have another Clinton close tied relationship where this guy is a billionaire and shoots himself in the head against all odds being signaled by his family and close friends that he would never do such a thing. The people are saying this is another Clinton body count because Lee was a longtime friend of the Clintons and they visited his Hampton, uh, East Hampton estate regularly and Bill Clinton frequently played at Lee's famed golf club. The Clintons have not commented on the case but the government is quick to call it a suicide. Um, in these types of cases where family and friends are making comments that th the guy would never kill himself, never shoot himself like this, uh, but the government sits back and they seem to uh, will put suicide right away on the death certificate. But family and friends say that he would never, that Lee would never do such a thing. That's what his inner circle is stating, that Lee would never do something like this. So the government is a matter of who we're going to believe the government or are we going to believe the people? Do you think this billionaire is another Clinton body count enforced by Bill and Hillary Clinton? Please leave us your comments below and share your thoughts with us on this topic. Please share this video with your friends and look out for our channel on YouTube because they do not like conservative truth channels and have censored and hit our channel with every bad two they got.